how to fix can't give gifts or compete in tournaments after turning on two-factor authentication in Fortnite. Welcome to another Fortnite tutorial video. In this video, I'm going to show you a couple different steps that hopefully fix an issue where you've enabled two-factor or multi-factor authentication in Fortnite, but you still can't give gifts or compete in tournaments in Fortnite. And if this video helps you, please consider giving it a like and also subscribe to my channel because that really helps me out. All right, so the first thing I would recommend doing if you've already enabled two-factor authentication, but when you go to Fortnite, you still are limited on your features. Within the Epic Games website here, where we enable two-factor authentication, scroll all the way up and go to account settings. Once you get to account settings, under account information, go to ID right here, and we just wanna get this number, then go to Fortnite, and this can be on any device. And once you have Fortnite open, go up into the top right, select your avatar, then go down to the gear for settings, and in the settings in the top bar, go all the way to the right to account. Now, if we go to Epic account ID, it'll show us our account ID and we can compare the two and make sure that we have enabled two-factor authentication on the same account ID that we play Fortnite in. So these two numbers here should match up and be the same. If these two IDs match up, I recommend submitting a support ticket to Epic Games and check the description. I do have a link to there to where you can submit a support ticket. Just provide them as much information as you can. But if these do not match up, go back to the Epic Games website, go up to the top right and select sign out. Now, what I found to fix this issue is changing what you use to sign in can really help. So if you started playing Fortnite on say an Xbox and you created your Epic Games account through that, Try signing in with your Xbox account and seeing if that works for you where you get the same account ID. You could do the same if you have a computer and you're using Steam or you're playing on a Switch or PlayStation. Additionally, if you created your account with an email address, just make sure you're using the correct email address when signing in. So if for some reason you have multiple Epic Games accounts, you wanna make sure you're using the correct login. All right, so that's how you fix an issue with Fortnite multi-factor authentication, where after enabling two-factor authentication, you still can't give gifts or compete in tournaments. If you have any questions about this, leave a comment below. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. If you'd like to see more Fortnite tips and tutorials, check the links in the description. If this video helps you, give it a thumbs up and please consider subscribing to my channel, Gaging Gadgets, for more gadget reviews and tech tutorials. Thank you so much for watching.